I had an ex call some dude over oh, who no. liked her to put the TV up, <laughs> oh, and then no. the nigga got drunk and fell asleep at the crib. Oh, so no. she called me oh, to no. potentially fight this nigga. Oh no! Any man, I'm gonna be honest. Go ahead. Every man I've asked to put something together, it was like rocket science to them. I don't yeah. know if it's my type. <laughs> I don't know if it's <laughs> you like the nerds. Yeah, they, they yeah. yeah, they're not good with stuff like that. Yeah. You know, I don't date guys who are handy. Damn, you never dated a handy guy? No. They're always like the computer guy Mm -hmm. or like the tech guy. Mm -hmm. Or the gay guy. Satan cilantro like that. <laughs> we gotta maybe you smoke the other one and I'll keep this one. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> okay. Some two blunts, these guys. Right. <laughs> Cousins, like here you go, cuz. <laughs> I'm straight edge. You guys didn't know that. <laughs> I thought you smoked weed. Huh, I don't want to get you contact high. Yeah, it's not that serious. I, st- I started smoking weed at uh, the tender age of eleven. <laughs> that is a tender age. Yeah. <laughs> when when did you lose your virginity? Right. My virginity, sixteen. Oh, that's a pretty that's yeah. Right. I was I was expecting like the same year. <laughs> oh, she was no, hoping no. she was hoping you were molested. <laughs> <laughs> well, usually that's the story, right? Smoking weed at eleven, you probably right. got no. You're probably fucking your teacher. <laughs> no, I will say this: there was like the first beer I had was a Steel Reserves. And this guy, this random guy, me and my best friend hanging out in the private. My mom went to the Bahamas for the summer and left me and my sister there. So I was just doing wild shit all summer. Damn. So this dude was like, yo, y'all y'all be drinking? And <laughs> we lying as young boys. We like, yeah, we be, come on. Now. <laughs> I mean, of course you're going to say that. Kid, right? <laughs> so <laughs> Who he, wouldn't at 11 be like, hell uh, yeah. <laughs> so, so this nigga give us a, a still reserve to drink. That's 211 for my niggas. And... <laughs> We drinking this jaw, and he like, yo, come through here. We doing this, we doing this, and like the the mother in me, because I was raised by my mom. The mother in me was like, this feel a little creepy. Watch this grown man <laughs> giving you two elevens and trying to let yeah. you chill at his crib. I was like, yeah, where is it? Let me uh, let me go back home real quick. I, I and got and that you. man we know today was Jeffrey Dahmer. <laughs> <laughs> Hardcore. Molested. That's what he used to do. Hardcore molesters on his block. Normal molesters give you candy. This motherfucker was giving you beer. He was going straight to the. <laughs> a couch. smarter molester, Dog. actually. <laughs> we had we had a serial dick beater uh, around my way. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, dog. She was <laughs> his name was Captain Crunch. <laughs> no, no, it was a it was a big jaw. She would ask you for uh she would ask you for the room, like yo how you get here and thank you by beating your dick. What? Mm-hmm. Wow. Sucking it a little bit too. <laughs> that's, that's awesome. Just a little bit though. For free? <laughs> yeah, for oh. free. Wow. She got like 19 niggas on my block. Oh. That's <laughs> crazy. That's what Google Maps is missing. <laughs> <laughs> turn, turn left, let me touch your dick. <laughs> That's crazy, man. Okay, Matt Butler. What's going on? Friend of the show. Thanks for coming back on <laughs> Thanks again. Thanks for having me, per usual. I like when you come on because I think you say smart things. Oh, thank you. And I think Kiss Off needs that considering. <laughs> <laughs> Like, I we're always such you. doofuses, and then Matt just comes up with, like, some really, like, thoughtful-ass shit to say. We're I, like, yeah. It's like I ain't trying to dick but Matt is, a, Matt is a smart guy. Oh, He's thank yeah. You. Yeah, man. You're putting on, like, this. Put, Matt's got, like, yeah, this, I'm like, in an awkward position right now. <laughs> 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 it's not like you're getting interviewed by Sway, though. You're like, yeah, you know, man. Just, <laughs> just, <laughs> man He's a chilling. genius. <laughs> Yeah, don't know not too much, man. No, I appreciate you coming back. Uh, and look at all these upgrades. It. That's we what I'm saying, man. We're moving on up. Moving man. This on is, up. Yeah. This is progress. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. And Jay's on now. Yeah, Jay's on. Jay's on. G I C. Guy in chair. G I C. G I C. The head G I C. You need a mini fridge <laughs> under there, bro. Call me the geek. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> That sounds like a slur. Yeah, it does, it does. <laughs> for Asians. Oh, you yeah, for sure. Wall? Did you put this up yourself? I did. It's, it's from Target. 
It looks oh, like right. somebody's grandma's couch in the future. <laughs> I know, <laughs> right? I think <laughs> <laughs> I liked it because the colors are like literally kiss off colors. Yeah. Oh, the, the and it looks it's crazy. Like, it looks it's like, like Tupac Clubhouse. Meets, it's like Tupac meet, meets kiss off. What's that? Mean? What's that black? I like what's that, that black lady fraternity? They gonna come at you for oh, having you this green and pink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, what is it? You might be a poser. AKAs. They gonna beat the shit out you when they oh, catch you. Oh well, I've already got beaten the shit out of Don't a be black girl gang here. before, so it wouldn't be the first time. Actually, this I got is, jumped. I got jumped when I was sixteen. This is a high level black jumped. girl I gang. Jumped fourth grade. They work in they work in like law and shit like that. So not only will they beat you, they'll take you for they'll sue you <laughs> and get money out of it. Right. Damn. Well, bring the mood down. Yeah, way to go. <laughs> now I gotta change the whole brand. <laughs> you know how long it took me to put this wallpaper up? Who has Five green minutes? and pink? Nobody. <laughs> right. <laughs> All right, what's the first topic? Boom, let's go to the news. Dun, 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 to dun, the dun, news. Dun, 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 to the news. Oh, Tina Turner died. Yeah, we didn't talk about that because we didn't have Kiss Off last week. It was a holiday. Um, we take know. holidays here on Kiss Off. We take holiday I days. Can take it. I can nice. Take it. Y'all got. Uh, hopefully, y'all paid yourselves. <laughs> <laughs> I know you're joking. Here, Malachi come with the uh, with the uh, the incorporated now, the, uh, nigga sl- uh, nigga nigga advice and shit. <laughs> <laughs> if I'm taking a holiday off Get from you. work, I'm paying myself. Every time yeah. Malachi says something negative afterwards, I'm gonna put the wah wah wah. <laughs> 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 I'm Debbie Downer. <laughs> 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 they my bed. That's yeah. a paid holiday. Damn yeah. not, it wasn't worth it. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's going to be hilarious. Keep doing it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, oh, Tina Turner died. What it was to oh, say, man. legendary rock and roll singer, age 83. Does, she, does so that get a wah, wah, wah? I feel like that's <laughs> <important. laughs> yeah. uh, uh, I mean, she had like cancer or something for like a long time. So. Yeah. She was like living out of the country though, living yeah, her best London. life. Yeah, 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 I thought it was Switzerland, somewhere. Yeah. Oh yeah, somewhere she, it does say it in here that she died somewhere over Wait, I don't have my glasses yeah. on. Why'd they put a picture she of Rod like, Stewart up? <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that a dude from Aerosmith? Yeah, <laughs> Bon Jovi. I do, I do feel bad though because when she died, I was like. The first thing you think of is the movie about her and her I, Angela like, Bassett. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and this was, it's like such a negative thing to be known for. Right. Like not not, not like negative, but like because yeah. obviously she like made a positive thing out of it. But that yeah. movie was so fucked up. Yeah, it she, was. Yeah, she was Mary J. Blige before Mary J. Blige. You know, she was getting her ass whooped for years and then turned it into a positive. Was Mary thing. J. Blige getting her ass whooped? Oh man, well she had a whole like. I don't know the breakdown between all the stuff Mary J. Blige went, but if you listen to her albums, you can kind of just like it goes from oh. like yeah, I'll struggle bus. She has all the way one to like happy song. <laughs> right, like, all Mary J. Blige songs is set. She either she either c- attempted suicide a couple times or she been in she been bad in relationship shit. at the bad relationship. Yeah, I, think yeah. not, I think she's talking about the same deadbeat dude for the past twenty years. Yeah. <laughs> that would make sense, <laughs> bitch. Yeah. It's you. <laughs> it's you, Mary. Oh man. <laughs> Yeah, Tina Turner died of intestinal cancer. Ooh. Yeah, I mean that sounds so painful. Like she had a kidney transplant man, in 2017. Right. You can't even enjoy hot foods and shit because your <laughs> intestine. <laughs> <laughs> that's real. Maybe that's, that's real. why she moved out of the United States. She's yeah. like, I can't eat the food. Right. <laughs> Spicy shit. Give me this bland white shit in Switzerland. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you know what was crazy? Bland ass pasta. I see me me growing up. I've seen what's love got to do with it so many times. Yeah. So many times. Me and my sister could act out the scene where Everybody. I could beat beat Tina ass in the uh, pool house. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. okay. <laughs> well, how many times did they play that movie on VH1? I mean, like religiously. Time. We had the tape, yeah. so oh, my mom watched that. Oh, you didn't even need it. It was Friday. on VH1 like every day. Every day. Well, definitely. <laughs> my mom. It still su- probably is. My I mom know. wanted to support. Tina Turner, <laughs> oh, so she bought the thing. Man, five heartbeats, uh, fucking the, the Tina Turner movie, right? What's love got to do with? Oh, we talking uh, about classic black movies. Now. Yeah, like Baby Boy, fucking all these movies they played a gazillion times. Yeah, and and you so had to have them all. You had VHS. To. Well, rest in peace. Damn. Right. Yeah. I thought that I read something on the internet that said she had her first single hit at like forty something. Was when after all that shit happened, and she came back and had um, what's you, it called? Yeah, because she was in a band together with Ike, mm-hmm. so like 
He right, and he that. owned all her yeah. shit. He owned her. So yep. she came back. She kept the name and mm-hmm. sued him. Right, she only wanted her name right in the end. Yeah. That's all she asked for. Oh, the drama. That was great. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, nah. But, um, great movie. Damn. And Phil Spector is also like super fucked up. He produced most of their records. Oh shit. I forget what Phil Spector did. I think he like killed his wife or something. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, he killed his wife. Shit. Right. Music yeah. business. Yeah. 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 Everybody in the music and business. And some Looking of the shit in the Whitney movie we talked about the other week, I didn't know. Yeah. I didn't know she was a lesbian. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Secret lesbian. Man, you couldn't talk and about that, that stuff. And that they were hitting, they were hiding it and all the, like, oh, yeah. they were fucking. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So many secrets. So many secrets. That's why I love these movies. Any any movie, any autobiography you want to see out of somebody? Man, you know what movie? I want them? I want them to turn um, big time. Uh, so DMX has an autobiography, like a book. I want them to turn that shit into a movie, man. I bet it's that'd called, be good. It's called Earl. Like, it's because his real name is Earl, yeah, right? Earl Simmons. But it's like, I don't know. I think they turned it into like. He looks like an, an Earl. acronym or something. <laughs> but if they turn that shit into a movie, Earl. man, that shit would be like a billion dollar fucking box office. I need them to get Anthony Mackie to play DMX, though. Bruh! <laughs> 100, dog. Who? Clarence? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Who is it? Anthony Mackie. I agree. Bring him up. Anthony, uh, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, Papa Doc. Uh, <laughs> Isn't he a little too good looking? Sure. Uh, sure. I just I because <laughs> sure. I I want I want him to play the movie because he doesn't look like DMX at all. Yeah. And I want because like every good uh, biopic, no matter if it's good or bad, people are like this person don't look like them. I right. just fuck. Nowadays you like can this. make anybody look like that's anybody. True. But yes, the, the guys that they true. do get to look like them are like. Not good actors. Not like the Tupac good. guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, he looks like Tupac, but he'll only ever be able to play Tupac. Right. You know who else also played Tupac? Anthony Mackie. A nigga on YouTube called him Anthony Machiavelli and that shit. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, now they're putting, they're literally putting faces on the bodies. So yeah. who knows the next nah, 10 real. years where you're literally be able to just make whoever you want and put it on an actor's body. They're right. going to keep faking actors in 10 years, I agree. Because look yeah. at that fucking Star Wars shit. They put young Luke in there. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah. They um, put in uh, Carrie Fisher. She's already dead. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. What? That bitch floating through space is a dead lady. So next 10 years, maybe we can have anybody we fucking want yeah. and make it look like whoever. The next topic. What do we got here? That 70s show actor, Danny Masterson, also known as Hyde, convicted of two counts of rape and faces life. Oh, yeah. Damn. Damn. That shit broke my heart when I first heard that story, bro. Because Hyde was like the coolest one, man. He was like the cool dude on the show. Go ahead. <laughs> We're waiting. <laughs> he deserves He deserves that time. Okay. But who did he rape that they gave him life? This is the first time. I think multiple never people, maybe. That shit never happened. It says so. two right now. Uh, oh, yeah. two counts. Bill Cosby raped like 90 people this and got thing. out in five years. Like, <laughs> Not even. Yeah, right. So, you know what Five I mean? years. He's yeah. out now. Yeah. He had to rape a princess or something. Cause that only <laughs> 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 no, he raped princess from Mario. Right. Because <laughs> people don't. Beach, I said, we, people don't care about women's lives like that. So, why the fuck. <laughs> It's they do bro. Like it's Bowser. Right. He's like a Bowser and shit. <laughs> That's crazy. Mario was like, we got a boss. Is that a boss? I, I don't feel that. Because there's the, the, the one thing we know about the law is it's not fair. Right. <laughs> like none of it makes any sense and none of it is fair or makes any sense. So I agree with you on that. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, I'm so glad that Hyde wasn't my guy in that show. I'm yeah. just so glad because I know the girls who liked Hyde. Yeah, you know, yeah, I'm just yeah. so glad oh he wasn't God. my guy in that show that I liked. <laughs> Any guy who's been me too and yeah. we talked about this before, I'm like, There's only okay, one. I can live with that. It's yeah. no one that's hurt me really bad. There's only yeah, like yeah, one in a I movie and the show who wasn't, right? It was like um, the main dude and fucking Ashton Kutcher, right? Oh, yeah. I Obviously, I loved Eric. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> you know, I was I love the nerd. I was in love with Eric. If he gets me too, I will be very upset. <laughs> Knock on wood. I don't see him here. He has Not potential. Tofer. 
That'd be rough. Very good. Yeah. It says here, that 70s show star Danny Masterson was let out in handcuffs from a Los Angeles courtroom Wednesday and he'll get 30 years to life in prison after a jury found him guilty in two of three counts of rape at a second trial in which the Church of Scientology played a central yes, role. Yes, I did know oh. that. Oh. I did know that. Yes, got you got your answer, Scientologists. Bro. Yep. Yeah, Scientologists. So my sister did tell me don't that. Fuck they, they don't play bro. that shit. They don't play that games, man. Yeah, I mean, well, I'm surprised he's actually getting other. time. You think they're not going to snitch on somebody else? Bro? Right. That's because like usually the it. Scientologists get away with it. <laughs> yeah. Because yeah. they're such like, they stick together so much. Yeah. Did you see the they thing just, with um the the lady from King of Queens? Yeah, she has that podcast. Yeah. Too. She, she yeah. has a podcast too about how she talks shit about all of them. She was yeah. in the church her whole life. Yeah, then she got out and they was, they first of all, they started playing little kid games. It's like, yo, she gay as shit, dog. And yeah. then they started elevating that shit and like trying to like make her, make sure that she could never work in Hollywood again. They was really going hard. It's like, you supposed to be about religion and loving your guy. Why are nah, you worried about? So cold, bro. They're it's about late, money. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, they're about space cold. aliens, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that um, what they believe in? Yeah, yeah. So you didn't see that South Park episode? <laughs> <laughs> I bet I reference this shit. As the South Park episode, but you right, well, they're man. always right. South yeah. Park's always spot on. Yeah, yeah they they should, like they explain like what happens with the uh, Scientology and Scientology, and then underneath it says this is what they actually believe. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Something yeah. about aliens crash landing here and their spirits going into like early men. And yeah. that's why we depressed and everything like that or some shit. So what Tom Cruise be preaching about all the yeah, time, basically? <laughs> pretty much. Yeah, check your feet and Steve. <laughs> uh, it says here, the jury of seven women and five men. Damn. You know, if, like, if you're getting convicted seven of women, rape. Yeah, and you there's like a rap. Yeah. Seven women and five dudes. It's like, I'm yeah. going to jail. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> For sure. Have you guys ever been on jury duty? Yeah. You've uh, actually made it? Yeah. No, because I got through the thing, but I didn't make it through the next you round. You wanted to do jury duty? No, but oh, I want to, like, oh, how did you get picked, you think? I was too honest. I got <laughs> picked, and then the dude was like, just for being honest, we ain't going to call you for the next five years. I was like, y'all can do that? He's like, I'm doing that. <laughs> not, not that they look They say in your it's eyes. every year. Y'all can do that. Huh? I didn't get jury duty until, like, four years ago. Right, I I just got mine last year because all the backed up COVID shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I had to sit through the whole thing and they didn't choose me. But you, I don't know why because they're looking every time a case, they're looking for a specific something. Yeah. But I think because I, I put I'm a journalist, I don't think they're really looking for somebody who yeah, who's uh, like has experience yeah. in court. She gonna like I've covered something. court cases. I don't think they would want to choose me. Yeah. You know oh, what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> so what was your court case? Uh, Basically, it was... um. A crackhead trying to get money out of somebody. I, it was it was like eight years ago, so I don't remember the specifics. But it was a crackhead trying to get money out of this old lady. She wasn't having it, and his witness was clearly his drug dealer. <laughs> oh yeah, <laughs> only person who witnessed the crime <laughs> where he was hurt. Like oh, he fell off a ladder or something like that. I think he was on the ladder trying to steal from this lady, <laughs> and um, the only person who saw it was his dealer. Wait, so he fell off the ladder trying to sue the lady or something? Yeah, because uh, it was on her property, but he was trying like, to steal from her. Liar, property. liar. Yeah. I would have got him dead. <laughs> <laughs> I'd have got him dead. That's a bad job. Yeah. That's a bad job. And yeah, then damn. what did you decide? Are you not allowed to talk about it? No, you're allowed to talk about it after the case is closed. Yeah, it's been... Yeah. We we all look... Because like, they Guilty? tried to... They all tried to like... They try to even out like the white people and the black people. So, because uh, it was like, if we got enough white people, they might not know what's happening here. Yeah. But all the black people, we look at each other like, that nigga's a crackhead just trying to make some money. <laughs> Everyone's like, yeah. <laughs> that shit was over in a day. You made, wow. you made Judge Mathis proud today. <laughs> right. <laughs> Well, it was like Math- you figured out the crackhead, young man. Yeah, I know a rock star when I see it. <laughs> Judge Mathis never fails to call you a crackhead. Right. <laughs> You're a crackhead, man. It's okay. Did you it's smoke, okay. Did you smoke crack today? Did you do it? <laughs> you used to. <laughs> like, like, you, you used to not today? even once. <laughs> not even <laughs> once. Okay, I did try. There you we sure? go. <laughs> Trust because I know. I know. <laughs> All right, now. I can see yeah, it. As he called you a crackhead 19 times, he tried to walk away like, yeah, I had crack in my family. <laughs> like, exactly. He tried to make you feel good about it and shit. Like, <laughs> you know what's crazy? Okay. Those shows are still going. They're even adding new court judges. And I just saw a commercial. I'm like, I can't believe that those didn't like. Daytime. You know, eventually go away, you know, mm-hmm. like that oh, daytime no. TV yeah. courtship. Court but people right love that yeah. shit. Yeah. Yeah. My yeah. mom still watches every episode of Judge Judy. Who is it? Uh, who is it? Uh, 
Man, I am in love with the uh, chick on divorce court. Judge, oh. Judge Toler, Miss Toler. No, Lynn, <laughs> Lynn Toler. I do is like bad. her. I do I mean, like her. Uh-huh. She like fifty nine right now, but yeah. she's still looking. Woo. She always has the most drama. Yes. Oh, yeah. You saw the rolling it's like right? You know, what? you know Roland Ray? He was on there? The gay guy, yeah, the gay guy in the wheelchair? Yeah. Roland Ray is on an episode of the Divorce Court, and he's like rolling around the court. <laughs> like, like I told you, Miss Toller. <laughs> 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 the best part is like, and and more drama after the, after the break, and then it comes to the defendant, and he's like, he told me that Beyonce bailed you out of jail two times. <laughs> Beyonce don't know you. <laughs> it's just... <laughs> Just the best game. It'd be the craziest lies. Be the she don't lie. know you. <laughs> <laughs> With the gayest eyes. <laughs> right. Your upper body got to be twice more sassy when you boot when you your, your, your lower half. <laughs> <laughs> you got to make you up gotta, for it. Two snaps. Yeah. It can't be one snap. Yeah. You got to you got to make hilarious. up for it. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god! Why am I? <laughs> <laughs> I'm weak, literally. I am here with this man. Oh my god, he wants to be a little girl. He doesn't even dress like a boy. Like, what the fuck is happening? Yeah, because then they got the uh, the caretaker too. Like, like and there's like, and your friend here. And it's yeah. literally just like, it's like a guy in like an all yellow. Suit I didn't ask just... to be here, right? Exactly. Yeah. That's and little like Bert and Ernie over here. <laughs> They're like, I should. Yeah, like, I should have watched white kids instead of this <laughs> bullshit. <laughs> so yeah, Roller Ray used to be a menace back in the day. That's hilarious that he going on. Uh, oh, yeah, I'll, I'll send you the clip. It's the funniest episode see, of yeah, Daytime. Yeah, I, I need to see this. Yeah, I went to see this. Just two, guy, two, two gay guys clapping at each other. Of course they clap. Beyonce don't know you. You don't know who I know, do you? He was sending him right, pictures right. from uh, men and sending them fake. He was sending them like he was sending dudes fake pictures of women and getting money. Oh shit! Nice. Yeah. So they had this whole like. Racket. I feel like that's. I, I feel that's like that's like forty percent yeah. of the of the women the, the, pictures the, circulating online oh, are dudes sending pictures to get money. Yeah, I feel like yeah. Like, your pictures. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like like what is your what is that your feed on Instagram? Just bitches that don't oh, exist. Yeah, right. <laughs> right. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The most love yeah. I get, the most love I get on Instagram is from bitches that don't exist. That's I'm what not I'm going, saying. Yeah, That's they always like my story. They mad supportive. And yeah. I'm gonna say same. <laughs> that ass same. They do it to me too. It's so annoying. It'd be some random uh, Russian chick with they stupid upside down letters. Right. Yeah, like fucking all suck my me shit. off six six nine yep. Sports Central. I'm like, I don't think I know her. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? I appreciate the clout, so right. I'm not gonna stop in it. Right. <laughs> I'm like, you baby? liking it? No, okay. Right. <laughs> yeah, so you're, Never like, stop you. Like when you like swipe on Tinder and you see like those. Uh, those Chinese girls that just look like sex bo- robots. Mm. Like, oh, mm-hmm. Jesus. Hi, my name's Gertrude. Right, 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 right. right. It's always like a super American name. Yeah. Right. Oh, I love fucking with, uh, I love fucking with them and I love fucking with like African scammers who be trying to get you out of money. Oh, I actually yeah. got $5 from a uh, um, African scammer. That must have been amazing. What? Yeah. That's like $3,008. <laughs> 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 the nigga was bad at it. He's an African scammer. He had, he was speaking broken English, and yeah. then uh, he had a black girl's picture up. So uh, I was like, "Oh, where you from?" Uh, He's like New York. And I was like, "Oh, uh, you Caribbean?" He's like, "Yeah." So I said some shit in Patois, and the nigga said something I don't even remember. So I was talking to him, and he's like, "Yo, I I need you to send me like a couple dollars." Like, listen, I can't send you money because my my cash up doesn't know you. So you got to send me money first so I can send you the money. Because that's how they get you. They be like, yo, I, uh, if you, like, I can't send you money until you send me money. Right. So I hit him with it first. Like, listen, the way my cash is set up, <laughs> you got to send me money. If you want $100. But you still gave him your account. Yeah. Yeah. But he got a request. To, I hear what you say. My shit got like a, a double lock on it because <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I've I seen. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm, I'm cool. But still. Do you know how hungry you have to be to have somebody from Africa send you money? Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, listen. Lunch on this guy. <laughs> <laughs> I definitely got a cheesesteak platter with that. 
for just 70 cents a day. <laughs> I was like, Poppy. <laughs> Let me get it with the work. <laughs> Don't be stingy with the pepper. <laughs> you ball in a day. That's crazy. Good to know. You got, you got you him before that. he can get you. Yeah, That's crazy. I can finesse, though. Like, this guy seems genuine. Yes. Yeah, it's, it's, it's the eyes. I, I mean, that's yeah. what he gets. Fuck that guy. <laughs> I I know I've never been like scammed. I don't uh, think I have had had a door salesman once almost. Yeah. Like I totally signed and I was like, oh, like those electric people. Oh, yeah. oh I fell okay. for that. He was so charming yeah, yeah, and he was yeah. so cute. Yeah. I fell for it like, fully. That's how they get you. And right after scam? I was like, got, I think that I think I fucked she up. She got she had solar panels delivered to her. <laughs> 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 He's like, what the fuck is these? He's like, you remember the guy you signed with the papers? He's like, well, I didn't damn. even know. Like, that was like my first apartment. I didn't even know they had door to door salespeople. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They try to do it here in Philly, too. Honey, always. bitch, you baby. That's yeah. <laughs> they but some he sweet man was in front of you. so charming. Like, yeah. I couldn't. And, and I didn't feel as bad because I'm like, I know I ain't the only one. Yeah, right, <laughs> I know yeah, I'm yeah. not the only one. What, what did they scam you on? It, it, it's like they make you sign for like this electric and then. It's like some, it's like, I don't know. It's some bullshit. Yeah. It's like, and then I had to call the people in India and try, and I had to cancel it. Oh, it was all thing. It's all, yeah, it's all this, yeah. She's already on the shipping container. She's on her way. <laughs> <laughs> That's a bad Indian accent, but. I forget, but kudos to the guy. I bet he was making money because he was really cute. <laughs> mm-hmm. You got to have a high charisma to be a you gotta thief. Sales, sales that's, sales that's what I learned yes. in the yes. Elder Scrolls. Yeah. That's very true. <laughs> yeah. I dated plenty. <laughs> yeah, salesman. Yeah, yeah. Of thieves. <laughs> um, okay, what's next? Al Pacino and pregnant girlfriend, Nor Alfalfa. Alfalfa? <laughs> what does that's she look like? Bring up that name. photo, because I don't think I saw a photo of her. Uh, damn. 29, that's not that young. Leonardo DiCaprio would have him beat. <laughs> <laughs> He's got a new 22-year-old uh, he girlfriend, was, Leo. He was rolling over in his grave right now. Why would you dare? Right. Right. Uh, that's seven years too old. Too old, man. That's um, crazy. how old Al Pacino? Too 80? old to be having wait, kids. Wait, here's the thing, though. I thought it. I, I hear his youngest before that was like eleven, and his oldest is like fifty or something like that. Can you imagine having a younger brother or sister, eleven years old, when you fifty years old, bro? That's yeah. gotta be crazy, man. <laughs> That's why to my dad. Hmm. My dad. Yeah. His. Sisters, my sister's age. Oh shit! His sister, because sister. his dad okay. in Puerto Rico did not stop fucking, yeah. and he still was fucking. He just died at like ninety, and was fucking until the day he died. Ball, so you gotta go. Right, right. And he had like, I think that at the end of it, he had like dementia. But I remember going over there he last, and he had a coochie fuck, mama though. girlfriend. <laughs> yeah. I don't know where I am. Oh, that's right, in the <laughs> pussy. Right, <laughs> <laughs> pussy. <laughs> Put some pussy in front of him. He act a fool. Can you imagine coming to him and you just there? You're like, oh, shit, this is pretty cool. <laughs> Every time he had Every a new girlfriend. Shit, huh? <laughs> oh, yeah, it feels like, oh, shit. I felt this Damn, before. right, right. Every time oh, it was the first new. time. Yo, right, it feels right. like the first time. <laughs> oh, that's crazy. He's a virgin every time he's thirsty. Right. right. <laughs> But he got the muscle memory of a nigga that been fucking for 50 years. I'm about to tear your pussy out the frame. <laughs> Oh, I don't man. think that's how it's going down. <laughs> he's just fucking as soon as he nuts. He's like, two pump. Who are you? Get the fuck out of my house. <laughs> <laughs> he forgets he nuts and keeps going. Right. <laughs> where's the Where's the door? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Let me show you the door. Wait, where's the door again? <laughs> so how old does it say Al Pacino is? He's 83. He's, he's shit funny. crazy, bro. Oh, it's acting funny. Maybe, maybe do a reboot. 83. Al Pacino, ain't no way he been taking his, you know, good good enough care of himself that he he's still been, be sexually active. At he's been eating ginseng and macaro. He been around some Jamaican <laughs> niggas. So he's like, yo, take this, make your dick strong. Wait, what, what, what was that? <laughs> oh, All man. right, did you guys see? Did you guys hear about this kid? No, nah, what's going on? So his, uh, what was his name? What's his name? Cameron, Cameron Robbins. Robbins. So eighteen years old. This is going in the video we're going to watch is on a cruise ship with his friends, his high school friends after their senior year graduation or whatever. They dare him to jump off a moving Bahamas cruise jumps off. They have a video of him jumping off the moving cruise 
in the dark and then they send him a life vest. He's gone. And now this video is circ circulating around and they say they see a shark in the video. So let's watch this video. Oh, bro. Oh, shit. There is a video like in the Google Docs. That's hella unlucky, bro. And this was uh, like a week Sir, ago. You, ju you, you know, jumped no, yeah, you in jumped. the Bahamian water? No, yeah, but but the fact a that a shark infested. Shark, but yeah, but that it was a shark at night and he saw you. Like, right. you know what I mean? this must be blind. Apparently it's <laughs> shark infested. <laughs> What'd you say? He probably heard the splash. He's like, what's that over there? <laughs> it looks like a seal. A hungry shark. <laughs> right. Oh, man. I might as well go in there on my period. <laughs> that just remind me of when your mom just be like, uh, you know, if, if your friends jump off a cliff, you going to jump off a cliff. <laughs> <laughs> your friends dare no, you to jump literally. off a cliff. You going to jump off a boat, bitch. <laughs> Pretty much. He did. Okay. Well, okay. So this is kind of hard to see. Cameron, That's Robin, moving in the water, that little happen. thing the arrow's pointing to. Oh, 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 shit. Bye -bye. oh shit. So they drop him that buoy and he goes the other way. They think they're saying he saw a shark and he ran. Yo, this yeah, he you immediately disappeared. He got eight. Right, dude. You yeah. immediately disappeared. You got eight, bro. Do you hear that girl screaming for fucking bloody murder in the background? What kind yeah. of fucking. And everyone is like, I'm sorry, but like, who would do that? Like, we're trying to feel bad for you, but like, what were you thinking? Yeah. Leave it up to a white woman to over necessarily draw on a situation because <laughs> everyone said that her friend just died, but she's acting like that was her best, best friend. friend. <laughs> the girl in the background. Yes. Oh no, my Cameron. god! Yeah, just relax though. I, that makes me upset. Like if I if I was somewhere and like my best friend got shot and some girl I I kind of knew was just like, oh my god, ran, ran your street like she was your mama or something. Yeah, <laughs> my I baby. I would stop and just look at it with so much like I can see you slapping <laughs> Bitch, get the fuck out of here. You know you know that uh that Chanel Renee joke where she's like when somebody dies and they fucking uh and it takes them like ten minutes to tell you what happened. Yeah. That literally happened to me. <laughs> when my dad died, my sister did that and I was so upset. <laughs> That I couldn't even be up. I couldn't even be sad that my dad died. What do you died. mean? It took her like a long time to tell you. Yeah, like, she, to get it out. Yeah, she called. She's like, uh, 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 uh. I'm like, <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Fatima, what's happening? <laughs> <gasps> what? <laughs> Dang God! I'm like, she's traumatized. Fuck it, bitch. <laughs> I, it's I'm I'm in an Uber going to work. It takes me 25 minutes. I'm at work setting up, and I'm like, wait, my fucking dad just died. <laughs> I was like, hey, yo, I, I, I can't come to work right now. I got to leave. My dad j died. I just felt out 20 That's minutes That's wild, ago. because when I got a phone call about the death, it was like, that was the first thing. How much would you think you would have to be paid to jump off of a moving boat? Um, you think if somebody literally offered you money, it was like, I got five grand. Nah. Where's the, like where's the water? Like how that. high is it? In um, <laughs> how many diameters <laughs> yeah, <laughs> is the fall? But, yes, because I'll jump off. I'll jump off a small boat into some water if I have a life raft. But I'm not jumping off a. Yeah, why you jump, jump off, off the off boat the without, without the life anything? raft and have them throw it to you? Bro. I think right. this is a bad question for Black people in general. Yeah, yeah. true. Yeah. Because yeah. True. You're gonna have to be a lot of money. You wouldn't even put yourself in that situation. Yeah. yeah. Right. Some would say you jump off a boat for no money. <laughs> <laughs> there's that movie. There's that movie where the girls like, you know, those like, uh, like I don't really have a fear of sharks okay. because like I'm not near any water. Right, right, Do you know right, what I'm saying? Right, it's like right. one of those things. But if you mm -hmm. were to be in water near a shark, it'd be fucking scary. Right, right, right. Like those things where you go in a cage and they put you down. Oh under. yeah, yeah, yeah. Them joints there, there's yeah, that yeah. movie. I thought it was pretty good where they put them under and then all this crazy shit happens, happens and yeah. the thing breaks and they went to some like junky guys who were like, oh, I kind of, I'm drinking on the job. Like kind of thing. Oh, wait, did the thing like break and like it went all the way to the bottom? Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. It breaks and it goes all the way to the bottom. Uh, yeah. 127 meters deep. Yeah, <laughs> yes. right, that's how I do, man. I, just, I thought it was I'm pretty like, good. We have drones now. Like you can put a drone in the water and see everything you want to see. Why you right. gotta get in a cage? First of all, you put me in. That's well, I don't want to be in a cage. I just smart seen. Things. I don't want to be in a cage. Like what? I just seen a video of that specific thing, like a dude in a cage and a shark flexes teeth at him. Like 
T.I. eat you pussy, nigga. Right. As he was running, I was like, That's I would have got, no. Why would the you... cages don't even be strong enough. You, they just bite through the cage. Right. It's like <laughs> flaunting something in someone's face. Right. Kind of teasing the shit right. out of it. Right. It's, like like... Putting, it's like putting bacon behind, like, uh, a pencil <laughs> case. It's like, I, I could get in there if I really wanted to. <laughs> but... Uh, it's like just like the sharks go there like a strip club. Like, yo, man, it's like, <laughs> yo, boys, you can look, but you can't touch. <laughs> right. You guys going to the manatee tonight? <laughs> it's, a, it's a scammer fish. Like, yo, you, you, $20, $20. That's basically, you just described shark tail. <laughs> a shark tail. Yo, hilarious. Yeah. Oh, look at the baby. Uh, all right, well. So next thing we have, Movie is trip. this camera on? Because it turned off no, on me earlier. Yeah. Okay. It just turned off randomly. I love when that happens. <laughs> <laughs> They're remaking The Color Purple. They're remaking The Color oh, Purple. They are. We're yeah, going nice. to watch the trailer. Who? Did you hear about this? Yeah, because I, I remember they were saying somebody was going to be casted. In. I Halle Bailey. Yeah, 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 oh, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. I think it's her. They're twins, so I don't know which one's which. <laughs> Wait, there's Halle Bailey, there's Halle Bailey and Halle Berry. Yeah, there's yeah. Halle Berry and then there's Halle, Halle Bailey. Bailey, the twin in Ariel. I thought it was just a Chinese person. Halle Berry. Hey yo, hilarious. Yeah, you know that. I don't know, man. It's I'm not. We're, I feel we're, like this could go either way, really. What you think about it, Malik? I'm interested to know your opinion on that. I want to know if somebody eating some pussy in this movie mm-hmm. because pussy was eight in the book. Mm-hmm. It was at. Mm-hmm. Yeah, oh, really? Mm-hmm. Well, there's always a great sex scene in a book that they cut out in a movie. Of That's course. just always going to happen. Of mm-hmm. course. Because why do you think I'm even reading this book? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Right. I'm trying to visualize these I'm pussies bumping. I'm reading these 30 pages of pussy eating. Like, <laughs> <laughs> this is why we should make Earl the DMX biography of fucking movie. Because if you know half of the stories and scenarios that DMX went through, bro, between pit bulls and sex and all the other crazy shit, yeah, it's Robin that shit would be an amazing Super fucking movie. I'm just gonna Especially say that, that, that John, where he took, where he, he was on the set of that movie and he took everybody to Disney World oh, for yeah. some <laughs> random reason. <laughs> that would be great. That would, yeah, no. That would be yeah, DMX said uh, he used to rob people with a pit bull. It's like, yeah, it's, yeah. Like, it's like a bullet to chase you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, he did. That's like, actually... He would, he would, yeah, you could rob me with a pit bull. He, yeah. he would teach him how to run from cops, too. That's like, he would put, like, dead squirrel. He would get him to kill a squirrel or a raccoon, and then he would hang it on, like, a gate. And then he would teach them through that to, like, jump on the gate, to jump over it. So whenever he was running from the cops and they had he had to jump over the gate, the pit bull would be right behind him. God damn. Pit bulls are loyal as fuck. <laughs> They was full grown niggas. You ever heard about that? <laughs> you, ever, you ever heard about that story? Uh, about uh, this girl set niggas up in South Philly. She was I saw it on Facebook. She was uh, she would like lure dudes over to her crib and like in a, with the promise of sex and rob them. Mm-hmm. But she would have a pit bull in the closet trained to shut up. So when you there butt ass naked, a dude come out with a pit bull and a gun. And he like yo, how you train a silent pit bull? <laughs> Dog ain't panting or nothing. He's right. just very quiet. Like. He's like, oh, it's work time. <laughs> Not even a... <laughs> right, right. Let's just trailer first, and then we'll talk about it. God damn it. I really should just pay for it. <laughs> nah, don't. Then they win. <laughs> exactly. Who is that? I know the one is Halle Bailey. The other girl. I, I'm saying the dark Oh, the girl. other girl. She's making the, that face that... Um, that lady that played Obama wife in the biopic made. Viola Davis. <laughs> there we go. I need She's probably in this. No. That missed her? Today, our future talks about a place called Africa. She say our mamas come from Queens over there. That means that we royalty. <laughs> this movie doesn't need to be remade. Whoa, hold on. And she grew up in a be. Motherfucking Fantasia. Oh, yeah, that's what it was. It was Fantasia. Yeah, they put Fantasia in the street. My name is Fantasia Barino. I was just looking at Fantasia performing earlier. She got that good weight on it. With the cheetah print? God damn. Oh, Miss 
Ranch fries. Oh, they Cookie. trying to take every black person money. <laughs> right. This is star studded cast. Yeah, this show. She was the only one ever loved. Wait, Haley grow to be Taraji? Yeah, that's what I feel. Yeah. I can see it. I can see it. Put it on. This ain't me. Hush. We need to look. Damn. Oh yeah, her in it too. Damn. The dude that they got to play Mister looked like a cross between Danny Glover and fucking. God damn, can't remember his name. Steve Harvey. He like a Danny Glover, Steve Harvey band. This is a bold <laughs> new take. Was that really a bold new take? Uh, Does this movie need to be remade? Like, isn't this a movie that's like is like a timeless movie that no matter yeah. what, it's timeless. You don't need to do anything with it. Isn't it yeah. one of those movies? She's spitting his water. He's like, Next time I'll give him some lemonade pee. See <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there's so many. Like, I just don't. I just sometimes these movies like that they're touching. It's like just watch. The, the original one, one the is original still one. fine, is it, it not? Is, but it's been a minute. It's not like the CG, like <laughs> yeah, you don't need dead. CGI, we're, like to, yeah, there's no it's graphics. We're old enough to remember growing up with that movie. Mm -hmm. This newer generation isn't going to go that far back to watch a movie because we were uh, we talked about this before. It's that scenario of we didn't have a choice of what we had to watch. Mm -hmm. We had a certain amount of channels, and we had to watch that. And that was a movie that was on. Order now, if you grow up, <laughs> you can watch whatever you want. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Where Sun Coast videos are blockbuster. Yep. This movie was on AMC every fucking <laughs> twice a year, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like yeah. or whatever Thanksgiving or whatever. The, no, that's a like, good point. Yeah. Yeah. so I get that. Thanksgiving in February it was the only two times. <laughs> but why don't they just like remaster these movies and put them back in theaters? Because there's no money in that. Yeah, they know. <laughs> yeah, Hollywood. True. Yeah, couldn't true. fuck over writers or nothing like that. So they, if know. they know a movie's already gonna work, they know they're gonna make money off of it. Oh, it's true. basically like a one hundred percent guarantee yeah, your money right. back. Right. That's the thing with these Marvel movies and stuff. It, no matter no matter how many times you change Superman or Spider Man, you know what I mean. People gonna come just because it's a Spider Man movie. I know. Yeah. Like people yeah. came to that stupid Venom. People that made so much money that they made a second no, one. Venom. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we were talking because the people were like, "There's so many people that love Venom." Yeah. I yeah. guess there's Shit. a big. I've never seen either one of them. No, they're pretty the bad. first one was bad. Yeah. yeah. The second bad. one's even worse. Yeah. Yeah. I it's figured. like That's comedy. Yeah, yeah. They try yeah, to do it's the all, like, all the superhero movies. They gotta have like you know a hint of yeah. a little wink. And I'm, oh, this one was crazy. We're <laughs> tight. <laughs> right. You can you can thank Ant Man for that. Yeah. yeah. The and Shazam Deadpool. was bad. I heard. The new Shazam. The new Shazam. Yeah, with, it wasn't uh, as good as the. I had a I had a homie at work tell me he seen it on this weekend and it was good. I looked at him like I should slap. It's like your know. child, right, <laughs> sir? You forty six. Oh, yeah, that. <laughs> it entertained me. Was, like I wasn't yeah. bored. Bro, just tell me you can't read. <laughs> <laughs> but why? The problem I had with the new movies. Why you gotta? Why does it have to be my bridge that you have to collapse? Yeah. Did yeah. you see that? Yeah. Mm -mm. They because it's in Philly, so the bridge that was like collapsing for no reason. <laughs> Was in the new Shazam, and I'm like, I, it's fine if it's somebody else's bridge, but why'd you just have to put that image in my head of the Ben Franklin oh, falling? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. I remember seeing the trailer. The first one was like, is he on the L? Like, yeah, it's in it? Philly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. It's in Philly. That's a random change. It's random. Yeah, yeah. And the worst part was like, they. That's what the. You know how when superheroes like save a collapsing bridge, mm. they made it the Ben Franklin. So now I'm like, great, now I never want to take yeah, that uh, bridge. Uh, <laughs> our infrastructure bad enough without you. Right, exactly. exactly. You, you see our streets, bro? Can right. you come fix our streets too? Yeah. Like? How did that just collapse? You know, I see that. Right. Oh, is that where all the potholes are from? Right. Superhero fights? <laughs> <laughs> right, exactly. Right. Broad streets a mess from superhero fights. <laughs> <laughs> got it, got Shazam it. Shazam been out here putting work the last <laughs> seven right. years. Do you know, no, you know what's so funny? What was that? What's that movie with uh, Bruce Willis and his M. Night Shyamalan? Oh. Unbreakable. Um, that's oh, yeah, Billy, yeah, 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 and he yeah. died. They drowned him in a pothole. <laughs> you remember? <laughs> oh that? shit! <laughs> they did. They did that? drown him in a pothole. <laughs> Wait, I do remember that. Yeah. Uh, no. <laughs> That's a bad way to go out, man. Right. I was That's like, they didn't have to drown him in a Philly pothole like that. <laughs> the only, the only more Philly you could have got is if like they, they were struggling with a cheese stick while they was doing <laughs> <laughs> like, like, He should have just said. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> like it was, come on. So yeah, he's shaking that jaw. 
That's crazy. That's so funny. <laughs> That's hilarious. Leave it up to M Night. Right. Yeah, yeah he's trying to Step stick it in a puddle. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he always fucked with, like, signs always fucked with me because it was always, like, somewhere in Pennsylvania. I'm like, yeah. God damn it. M. Where? Like, why can't you make it somewhere right. else? Make it a jersey or something. Right. In the court, right. It's always so Even weird. the, uh, what's that new series he got on Apple? That joint, The Servant. Have y'all watched that? Mm-mm. Yeah, what's that? So it's like, uh, basically, this chick, she comes from this cult that, like, brings dead people back to life. That's, like, one of the getches in it, right? But Scientology. So, <laughs> right, basically. So the girl, so she's, like, a, a little, like a teenage girl now, but she's, like, um, like she doesn't have a mom. She doesn't because her mom, like, they all died in a fire, and they brought her back to life. The cult only brought the little girl back to life. So she's, like, looking for a mother figure and then finds this, like, random news reporter lady and then, like, wakes her way into her life to become her nanny. Like, because she has the reporter lady has a baby and becomes a nanny, but the baby dies. So she uses her cult powers to bring the baby back to life. The, 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 the you shouldn't be fucking with that. Yo. Man. Sometimes dad is better. But then. <laughs> <laughs> Bro, it gets crazy. Don't fuck with the dead. Yo, it gets crazy. So she, like, she starts to, like, the little girl uh, starts to have, um, like, bribes. The, the 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 broadcaster lady or whatever like that with the baby because she can kind of like take make the baby dead again and all this type of stuff so it gets really crazy but it's like it's like shot on like a uh, on like walnut or chestnut somewhere like where all like the brownstones are and shit like oh that. around here yeah, yeah 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 so it's 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 uh, oh, really it is cool to see city. it is yeah, really yeah. cool to see your town in a movie yeah. Like, it is always cool. But for, for Philly, it's always, like, the cliche. Oh, Do you man. remember uh, Flavor of Love? Yeah. yeah. I wasn't a big watcher back in the day, but I know of it. Yeah. I actually rewatched it because they put it on, like, Hulu. And I, like, rewatched it yeah. recently. Like, the first two seasons. I'm like, this shit's good TV. Yeah. You remember that girl with shit on the floor? <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> that was crazy. They didn't make that shit up. What's the one where the... Was, was, the, was the Flavor of Love with the girl named Chardonnay? <laughs> Maybe I think so. The white girl, I think it was. Yeah, so I'm gonna call you Sean. <laughs> it was always something weird. Yeah, oh, I, I mean, liked, I liked I Love New York. That show. Was I, I was gonna I talk like about New York. New York. Yeah, I so much, yeah. icon, fucking yeah, icon. Yeah. I will watch, and she's in that new reality show, and I just want to watch it because of her. Have yeah. you seen what I'm talking about? I seen what a clip it? where um she like this she was talking about like her uh child dying or something like that. Her dog, and, and it turned out to be her dog, and everybody was trying to get at her like uh. Like uh, like you were talking about your dog. We talk about Peter. He's like, my dog is my child, <laughs> and she started snapping. It was so funny. It was dramatic and shit for no she reason. She is the most entertaining, like reality TV star. I think Black yeah. China's mom's pretty good. She's evil. Yeah, she is evil. <laughs> I've been watching. Yeah. I've been watching a lot of stuff on social media. Scarlet. Oh, I the, want them to I give her, her something, bro. I fuck with her. Yeah, she Scar- need like a reality. Scarlet is the girl who made that song. Yeah. Uh, this is New York. Fuck, I look like oh, telling yeah, a nigga yeah, good morning. Good morning. Yeah. Yeah. Yo, she's so thorough, bro. There's a she's ooh, so fucking thorough. There's a fucking after this. There's a, a YouTube video that you gotta watch. Like, there's a lot of gangster rap out here, right? Yeah. There's this girl who got a song called "Doing My Thing," "Doing My Dance." Okay, I've heard niggas talk about killing people a thousand times like oh this is good music when I heard her sing this song I was like no she does this shit I believe <laughs> it. Right. this shit is so <laughs> scary she she rapping on the video she's rapping at a gas station with a tube top on jeans and a gun on her waist and I was like Ooh. Jesus Christ this girl ma- is marry her. me you got a sports bra <laughs> on and a gun in your face baby Dog. what's going on well she has nowhere else to put it yeah. true, <laughs> true. <laughs> so they don't put pockets in her shorts <laughs> they don't yeah <laughs> Arr- um I don't know why that was like a pirate um okay so, oh, so this delicious. is delicious she won one of the seasons right wasn't that she? I don't remember no, okay I, th- I thought it was uh, uh, in Flavor of Love it was Delicious one with the second season. Wasn't it Hoops? I thought it was Hoops. Hoops won the first season. And then Delicious, yeah. Oh, well, she's one. Uh, I think she's the twin. Maybe not. No, she's not. She's the second winner. She's season two winner. Wait, this All this shit stemmed from, because he was dating that huge bitch, Bridget Nielsen. Yes, and they but, were going to get married. But that was a, another she reality show. called them Foofy. Sh- <laughs> yeah, that was another Foofy. reality show. That was Surreal Life, maybe? 
it was a bunch of celebrities in a house together. Yeah, I'm gonna do. That's some how they met. Watch that. I think that's how they met on yeah. that show. Oh, okay. So, anyways, this is her, the winner, talking about Flav, which on a podcast, which I can't believe this. So you just we'll play it. And yes, yes, I love Flav. I would date mm-hmm. Flav in real life. Really, like yeah. to this day, especially to this day. <laughs> really, I would. I didn't get my chance. I love you. I didn't really get the chance to date him. I won the show, and in my mind, that meant I won him or we were going to start dating or whatever, but that really didn't happen like that. What's his zodiac? Stupid question. (laughs) Flav is a, he just had a birthday. How old is he? He's now, he was 55 then, and that was 17 years ago, so you do the math. He's at least seven. Right. That's probably why him and my dad are always together. Yeah, you know what? It's less his age for me and more... I liked him. Mm-hmm. I don't like a lot of guys now that I meet. She said still that this day, 70-year-old Flav, she was- To this day. day. <laughs> to this day. <laughs> to this day. To this day. Hey, man, somebody. What is it about him you think that- I heard Kevin Hart- um, It's probably, if I had to guess, his millions- it's, it's easy to be charming when you have millions of dollars. Some chicks are into that, though, because I, I was hearing uh, uh, Kevin Hart's wifey, Nico, talk about, like, how she likes dark-skinned, rough-looking guys like that. Like, uh, she niggas. thinks Samuel L. Jackson is a good-looking dude. Samuel L. Jackson is good-looking. Ugly. Kevin Hart is good-looking. Yeah. Flavor Flav, <laughs> Flavor Flav looks like uh, the Crip Keeper got skin no, wait, on him. Wait, wait, wait. wait uh, yeah, we have it hard to say. Crispity, crunchity, crackity, cone. <laughs> He's like, I'm at the roast and they call this nigga all types of crispity, crunchity, crackity, cones. Mm-hmm. I don't know, yeah. but in the show, he did, he he would give those crazy kisses. Name, Big Topic? Yeah, Big Topic. Do what my did. That's it right there. That's it right there. This bitch is a menace. Song is fire, too. But. She is scary. She if she told scary. me, if she told me, if she walked up to me like, "Yo, you cute, we marry," because I'm not <laughs> saying no to this woman. Who oh, started over? Started over? Because like, y'all gotta see her walk up. You like me, man? I'd be like my thug of buggers. Where's she from? Yeah. Oh, Cleveland. <laughs> <laughs> Makes sense, right? <laughs> She's like PMX. I just spent my heart like a motherfucking fan. Hit on my jewel on my neck like a cooler. This gas that I smoke in these papers is cool. Some rights on my chain, do two bands on my hands. I ain't tripping no niggas. I'm doing my dance. You find no one no wood, no one in the hood. Pull my bag. There we go. You have is this one bar where she talked about her childhood. It's <laughs> such a good boy. I step in the mud. Niggas on demons, I slide with the slug. Know some things that be on it. They kill over drugs. Ra, ra, that's the sound of the drum. I know you're gonna run, but your ass can't hide. Twist out my wings, 30 inches to buy. Cherry berry, what? Put the best on my walls, I'm beating the odds. I ain't one of your kids gonna play with your friends. Bitch, I ain't one of your kids gonna play with your friends. Damn. Just her head. I wouldn't cheat on her. Right. That's for sure. This, mm, I'm not even, I can't call her name because I'm scared of her. She looks like she can take dick, and but I mean like, give me your dick. <laughs> L- oh, listen. Listen how she explain what she do when she get her pussy ate. Is that a Glock in her pants? Yes. <laughs> Not you over, it, baby dad. Oh, yes. God. I like the mic hanging from nowhere. Yeah, that shit is fire. She had a random gas station too. Yeah. Oh. 
I'm finna smoke up to you like a door dash. God, Okay, but she's actually really pretty. The way, like, I wasn't expecting her to be, like, really pretty. What? What'd she just say? Pushing her, a nigga face in her pussy while she's smoking the wood? While he eating from the back? Who hasn't done that? <laughs> really, let's be honest. Damn. So bitches ain't shit. They gonna fuck up your mans. If her baby fell a trip one more time, he's dead. Right, right. She, she pushing the part for me, bro. <laughs> right. God, damn. All right, that child support coming to every first time. Right. Day, I'm right. sitting extra. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> sitting like it's dead, bro. You, you ever see that? You ever I see need that? a good credit with this bitch. <laughs> All right. Well, good convo. Hell Good yeah. yes. episode. Of course. Well, well. Episode 26. Vibes. All the vibes. This is my favorite all episode I was on. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> any, um, we're going to start anything coming up, Malachi, for you? Any shows? Any, like, thing you want to promote? Oh, I just, um, I just did most of my shows. I'm doing 12 Steps Down this month or next month. I forgot when. I just did a show with Sarah. And she's like, yo, let's do this thing. So Follow you at? Oh, uh, follow me at Perks and Cakos, uh, on Instagram and Twitter. I be posting memes. You be posting. Yeah. <laughs> you I be posting. <laughs> you posted some shit today that fucking had me dying. Dog, <laughs> did you? Did you uh, <laughs> I didn't see it, but follow Malachi if you want funny memes controversial <laughs> memes really yes. controversial the, the, i've been i've been called the the meme god of philly comedy but i feel like Whoa. naive is up there with me he be he be surpassed me sometimes a meme god you you've titled yourself yes. wow. <laughs> not even me I, be it's not so a lot, though. he be getting locked up a lot yeah, yeah. you're a legend you're a legend yeah, in the hood. Yeah. put some money on my books <laughs> niggas <laughs> <laughs> I need some tuna, some soups. <laughs> Thank you for coming on Kiss Off. Oh, no, this is fun. Thank follow you for and subscribe. Me. Matt? Definitely. You can follow me at uh, Matt underscore B, as in boy, underscore joking. Uh, I don't post as many memes. Uh, next month, it's probably be a few Thank shows. Thank God. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's my God. Next month, it's probably be a couple shows, so keep posted. Uh, I've been a little bit out the way, man, trying to get some life stuff together, but... Uh, Soon that's going to come back. And then my co-host, me and my co-host, Keep All Out, will be back soon. So keep a lookout for that. And, uh, yeah, just thanks for having us on, man. You know. Yes, definitely. I thought your podcast was so good. Yeah, it is. Keep doing it. Yeah. It is. It is. We got the vibes. (laughs) It is. (laughs) I was about to say something. Are you still at the same? Are you still doing it at Neil's? Uh, so yes, I mean, cause we, we've been on hiatus for a minute now, so we would have to kind of re, we got to restart. I got my heart process. broke, uh, early January and was distraught for a while. <laughs> I had to readjust. My schmoopy oh. pookie oh, fucked me up, she dog. She left you, dog. Oh, dog. Uh, we haven't had the time to catch up, but yeah, no, man. My schmoopy. Yeah. I, she's my, my schmoopy pookie, <laughs> dog. She's my schmoopy pookie. I, I start, dog. I shortened it. I was like, I start yeah. calling her SP. Then I start calling her ghost. <laughs> and then this bitch really got ghost on me. <laughs> <laughs> You got your heart broken? Yeah. Yeah. It's all I good told him. Just. I told him it was a lot fast, man. It was. It was. A lot fast. It was, it was that, was, that was, yeah. there. I, I was there. But you were in it. Yeah, he you was, yeah. fell and you were like, boop, 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 let's yep. do it. And mm-hmm. you know what? Yeah. I commend you for that because not everyone's down to fall. Do you, you know what I'm saying? Do you love after love? <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm a big selfie. I'm a, <laughs> I'm a big selfie. I'm always going to leave with my heart. So. <laughs> Way to end it on an <laughs> awesome <laughs> fucking note. Thank you so much, oh, Malachi. I swear to God. Um, Malachi. Hey, hey. Hi, welcome to Kiss Off. You've never been on Kiss Off before. I haven't. How's Is it feel? A kiss? What's happening here? Whoa, whoa. Is everybody? <laughs> Y'all you, can you in kiss. You're between two dudes right now, dude. <laughs> Do we have to kiss? Like, I mean, I, I won't stop you if <laughs> you want to. You I've just assume I'm I'm like, oh, they think I'm a dumb woman. But then I'm like, no, I am actually dumb. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> no, I get it. I be, I be mad racist so, when I be talking what? to other people. Like, they just talking about guns and drugs because that's the thing to talk about. But right. then there's other people who you say tell, specific yeah. shit. She be like, all right, really nah, yeah. you be doing this. Oh, this is a drug dealer. Right. <laughs> 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 an actual You're so authentic. Yes. Right. <laughs> oh, man. Hollywood execs. <laughs>